So if you are someone like me who is always running out of space on your iCloud, like this, if I go to my mail app, Apple will go and check for new emails and then it would quickly, quickly remind me that, hey, your iCloud storage is almost full. Like this, if I go anywhere, I'm always reminded that, hey, my storage is running out specifically on iCloud. So here is the thing. iCloud by default gives you 5 GB of storage. And whenever you enable iCloud, your photos are automatically getting backed up on iCloud. You really don't need to back it up on iCloud. You could choose to back it up on Gmail to, with your Gmail account. You can choose to keep it on your laptop. You can choose to keep it on your phone. My phone has 64 GB storage here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to settings. I'm going to click my name over here and go into iCloud settings. And you see over here, there is iCloud option right up here. I'll click that. And you can see here, your storage is almost full. Um, Apple is reminding this to me again, and I want to tell them, just stop this. Go to photos and click sync this iPhone, just disable this, simple. The moment you disable sync this iPhone, your iPhone photo library is not getting uploaded online. That really helps. Now go to manage storage account and go to photos again. You see photos is consuming 4.8 GB of 5 GB of space. So I'm going to click this and say turn off and delete from iCloud. And my photos are now removed from iCloud. I want to keep them just on my phone. There's one more thing. When you go to storage, there is a real possibility that something else is consuming your storage. So go to general and go to iPhone storage inside it and look at the breakup over here. There are times when if you scroll down to the bottom of the list, you see system data, which is consuming 22 GB. That is way too much. Uh, what you need to do here is connect your phone to a laptop, back up everything, and then reset all settings on your phone to completely format it so that the system data goes away. Otherwise, it is a little hard one to get rid of. I haven't used this phone much. I use it mainly for my uh, demo purposes and it still has 20 GB plus of system data. This is one thing about the Mac and the iPhone which irritates me too much system storage and the only way to fix it is to occasionally just format your phone completely, remove all data from it and put it back again. I know that sucks, but that's how it is. If this helps you, do like, subscribe. I'll see you next time.